This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at elements, compounds, and mixtures. Matter can be divided into pure substances or mixtures. Pure substances include elements and compounds. Mixtures can be either homogeneous or heterogeneous. We'll start by looking at elements. An element is a substance that cannot be broken down into a simpler substance by chemical means. All known elements can be found on the periodic table. In the periodic table, elements are arranged in order of increasing atomic number, starting with hydrogen. The structure of the periodic table is covered in a later video. Some elements exist as diatomic molecules. A molecule is an electrically neutral group of two or more atoms bonded together. Examples of diatomic molecules include hydrogen, chlorine, oxygen, and nitrogen. Next, we look at compounds. A compound is formed from two or more different elements chemically joined in a fixed ratio. Examples of compounds include water, ethanol, and sodium chloride. Both water and ethanol exist as molecules. Sodium chloride does not exist as molecules, instead it has a lattice structure. The different types of bonding and structure will be covered in topic 4. Compounds have different properties from the elements that they are made from. An example of this is the reaction of sodium with chlorine to produce sodium chloride. Sodium is a reactive metal and chlorine is a poisonous yellow-green gas. Together, they react to form sodium chloride, which is also known as salt. The compound formed, which is sodium chloride, has very different properties from the elements from which it is made from. And finally, we look at mixtures. Mixtures contain more than one element and or compound that are not chemically bonded together and so retain their individual properties. Mixtures can be homogeneous or heterogeneous. Homogeneous mixtures have a constant composition throughout. An example is salt water. Heterogeneous mixtures have visibly different substances or phases. An example is a mixture of oil and water.